Prince Long Meadow man is now under arrest, accused of trying to set JGS Life Care's Ruth's house in Long Meadow on fire. Leon Purvis live for us with the very latest. Leon. Chris, the FBI says 36-year-old John Michael Rathbun is the suspect behind this. The FBI is accusing him of attempting racially motivated arson. Now, they, they say this started, they started this investigation back in March when they found two white supremacist social media pages. Both of them targeted the JGS Life Care Nursing Home for a mass killing. According to the affidavit released by the U.S. Attorney's Office for the District of Massachusetts, back in early March, the FBI discovered two white supremacist social media pages where it promoted mass killings in the U.S. and elsewhere directed against religious, racial, and ethnic minorities. One of the users specifically made two choices for mass killings. The FBI says it identified one as Ruth's House, an assisted living facility for seniors of all faiths. In early April, they say a second social media post included a calendar that had the date of April 3rd as a day to target Jewish people. The FBI believes that user one and two are the same person. In the same affidavit, it says on April 2nd, the Long Meadow Police Department discovered a homemade device designed to cause a fire placed at the entrance of Ruth's house. It consisted of a five gallon plastic gas canister filled with liquid, which the FBI believed to be flammable gas. The crime lab tested samples of stains left behind, which turned out to be human blood. The FBI says that DNA belongs to 36-year-old John Michael Rathbun. The FBI says Rathbun was arrested two times in 2011 for breaking and entering at nighttime and another time that year for receiving stolen property. A search warrant was granted on April 11th. Western Mass News cameras were there at Rathbun's home on Lori Lane during their investigation. The FBI tells Western Mass News they took him into custody there this morning. He faces a pending charge in federal court in Springfield as well as two counts of attempted arson. Now, we reached out to JGS Life Care about the situation. They said they will release a statement tomorrow. In studio, Leon Purvis, Western Mass News.